The total area in which Texaco polluted is about the size of the state of Rhode Island. We are suing for environmental cleanup. The plaintiff's accusation is defamatory and not true. It's just false and wrong. Es que hoy decenas de hombres y mujeres están padeciendo cáncer y están muriendo en la actualidad. Chevron takes those kinds of allegations very seriously. There's absolutely no evidence that there's an increase in cancer. Chevron is fighting the claim and the men who they say have made up their story for their own financial gain. The analysis of our water and soil samples are proving that they're guilty of massive contamination. Esto no es contaminación. Esto es una explotación industrial permitida por la ley. So we're going down to have a little chat with the judge today. This is something you would never do in the United States. But Ecuador, you know, this is how the game is played. It's dirty. People are fed up with corruption. They're fed up with foreign oil companies. They just had it. Where is her cancer? In the liver. These people have been systematically poisoned. We've sampled every stream, and it has nothing to do with oil. It has to do with poor sanitation. This is about some of the most marginalized people on Earth. <laughs> Fighting one of the most powerful companies in the world. When you look at the science, they cannot really prove their case. In fact, we're having a trial. It's a miracle. It's a huge victory. 